Hello, Emily. Hi, I'm Luis. And uh, I just want to take time to make this video for you on this beautiful 16 Kia Sedona. Now, it's the first thing most people want to ask is uh, any rock chips. So, the is super clean. It does have fog lamps, which is good. Um, both sides, very nice. Okay. Nothing going on crazy there. Tires, got some nice Michelin tires. Practically brand new. Got good grip in there. Um, pop the hood for you. Look at it here. I mean, so much to look at. You know, everything's covered, but it is all there. It's clean. Now it looks almost brand new. Coming around. Just overall, the aesthetics of of it is good. No cracked windshield, everything's clean. Glass is good, it's been tinted. No dents on this panel, no dents on that panel. It's a little, little ding right there. Touch that up for you. But other than that, straight panel, rear bumper, it's clean. Rear bottom is clean. Trunk, glass, showing rear sensors. No dents on this panel. No dents on that panel. No dents on that panel. Oh, yeah, no dents. And then same on this side. Um, as far as the top goes, it's also in good shape. You have power doors on both sides. So here's the left, here's the right. Coming on over. It's got the floor mats in there. Got a charger, little cubby, probably a cup holder there. Um, three in the middle. It's got one little little boo-boo there. It's not bad though. It's got the sliding track at the bottom. Those are kind of nice, so you can just pick where you want the seat to go. Um, and then it folds up that way. Step back so you can see. It's kind of a unique way it folds up, but it gives you room to hop in the back. And you got three in the back as well. And by the way, this combination of color is really nice. This black with the red and the tan. It, it's, uh, it's showing up lighter in the video. It's a lot darker. See right there, it looks pretty light. It's about that dark. That's the true color of the interior in person. All right, um, so bringing this back down, it's a little tricky. I'm not even sure how to do it, to be honest with you. But you get the idea. There's the other side. Top is really clean. It's got vents all over, so that's good for the, for the passengers. I'll come around. Close that. Open the trunk, power trunk. There's your switch there. Barcodes on all the doors. Deep, deep trunk. Okay, so good for cargo. I mean, that's pretty good. I have a Yukon and this has more room than that. So I'm impressed. It's deep. Okay, and all these, of course, fold that's what you look that's how it'll be that's the nice thing about vans the center one in the middle you pull that lever and it unlocks so if you want it to be captain's chairs in the front you just get you can get rid of that um it's pretty nice 
Uh, so if you got like little, little, little toddlers, that's what I would do. That's how mine set up with the cactus chairs and it's nice. Cause you don't have to move the seats. Put around on this side. Everything's how it should be. Okay, go ahead and close that. And this door. It's a little dirty right there from coming in and out. We'll get that cleaned up. It's just dirty out here. I really like like this. I don't know. It's got like a Mercedes imprint, but it looks like carbon fiber. It's pretty sweet. Um, we got the gas door, your dimmers, traction control, Bluetooth, volume, cruise control, center dash, of course. It's got power seats with lumbar support. Just backing it up a little bit. Perforated seats, okay. It's got the mats in the front as well. Coming in here, you got your push to start. That's another nice feature. System check, it's checking the system on its own. Everything's good. Coming on over here, AC functions right there. Clean air, circulator systems, probably got a carbon filter in there. Rear, so all the rear is separate from the front, which is good. Um, down here you got your auxiliary and your USB. Heated seats, right and left. Triple zone, one, two, three. Okay, active eco mode, and it has the parking sensors. Also, all the little sensors on the bumper. I'm sure you're well aware of that. And then, of course, you know, your reverse. Sounds very strong. I don't hear any hesitation. Idling that 1500. Good response. Coming up here, it's got the series, and then it's got a CD player. Smaller dash, AM, FM. Tune it to something so you can hear the stereo, make sure it works. Okay, so it works. There's your little glove box. Car. Up here, your lights, and then of course your door openers. Power off. You got the kiddos, and you don't want them to be using the power options in the back. You can turn that off. So it's all manual. You can open. It, you turn that off, and then you open the doors for the kids, so they don't obviously jump out. We're we'll going to open the door again and show you the engine running while we're out there, so you can hear it. And here, pump it. Sounds good. Sounds like it should. Okay. So there it is. Once you see the whole video, please give me a call back. Or I'll reach, I'll reach out a little, a couple minutes. And we'll see what we can do. Get this in your driveway. Again, I'm Luis, and I'll be helping you out. Thank you.